Hi, this is Thresden, and this is part 22 of an ESO High Isle walkthrough. When we left off in the last episode to this series, uh, we were headed to the east coast of Aminos. We were looking for the nobles that had been shipwrecked. We think that they're somewhere along the east coast of Aminos Island. But on the way there, as we were riding there, we ran across this teenage girl standing there in the middle of the forest talking to herself and she looks like she needs help so we're gonna find out what she needs help with right now oh there's another quest maybe maybe i should have waited for an escort at aminos station with mother a dust-covered warrior finally my father is the overseer at broke rock mine he defends the prisoners laboring inside the mine from the gangs outside its camp. He's struggling, though. He thinks I can't help. I'm a Thama vocalist now. Uh, what's a Thama vocalist? I sing to cast spells. Father says I'm suited to be a court performer, but I want to help people. Mother wrote that Hadalid sea monsters attacked the mine. Father's sentries were supposed to escort me to the mine, but they never came. There's a mine on the prison island? The prisoners aren't villains. They don't ask for much, and House Mornard employs Father to give them what they need. Look, the mine's in trouble. Will you accompany me? I can pay, and surely Father can't say no, not with you there. What do you say? Sure, I'll go with you to Bro Broke Rock Mine and help you with the Hadalits there. The mine camp is just over that hill there. This is going to be fantastic! Can you imagine the look on Father's face when I arrive with you to help? He'll be so impressed. Maybe we don't mention that I left Amino's station without an escort, though? What's Brook Rock Mine? It's a place where banished prisoners work in exchange for warm meals, clean water, and a little protection. They unearth Ammonites for House Mornard. Father never let me leave the camp. He said Aminos was no place for a child. Yeah, I would say so. What are Ammonites? <laughs> you want to know about those boring old shells. They don't look like much to me. Father says mages use them to store magic, somehow. I never listened when Father talked about the Ammonites. Why would prisoners want the mine's protection? You know that the banished prisoners can never leave the jungle, right? Well, the jungle is dangerous. The mine gives them a place to work in exchange for a little bit of safety. Father employs a lot of sentries at the mine to ensure that safety. Why does the mine use prisoners? Who else would do it? They're the only ones here. Prison labor is plentiful and cheap. The mine offers them short contracts. Agree to work for three months, get room and board. A lot request to stay on longer or leave and return later. How does House Mornard have ties to Aminos? They control the whole island. Father says the aristocrats on the other islands don't know anything about Aminos. But there are lots of House Mornard representatives at Aminos Station. Mother reports to them once a season. Why do you need an escort? My magic can help people. But if Father had his way, I'd be stuck conjuring butterflies for nobility my whole life. Father never even let me leave the mine camp without three bodyguards. What are you doing on your own, then? Alright, Stadia suddenly crashed. Sorry about that. What are you doing on your own, then? I've been away from Aminos for a while. Father allowed me to get a better <coughs> education. Magic. Music. No one masters those things without teachers. I was lucky to find mentors from both the Bard's College and the Mage's Guild. How does singing help you use magic? Most mages cast a spell with some arcane gestures and their innate mental power. That's how a friend explained it. I don't... well, I can't. My music focuses my magic. I had to train with many renowned mages and bards to get where I am now. So you play music to cast spells? Sort of. My music is the spell. Once as a child, 
I sang a little ditty and turned the cooking fire green. One of my more eccentric tutors liked to babble about tonal architecture. Uh, but even he didn't understand it. I'm sure my songs are easier. That sounds like a particular character I remember. Can you tell me anything any can you tell me anything else about the Hadalits? Father never let me get close to one, so I've only seen them from a distance. They're covered in thick shells and have beady eyes. They seem to really like the shoreline and tide pools. Honestly, they don't frighten me. If Hadalids stay near the shore, what are they doing in the mine? I asked Mother the same thing when I saw her. She didn't have an answer for me. The Hadalids weren't in the mine one day. Then they were in the tunnels, attacking everyone who came near. Okay. There's a way shrine right here. I once hid from my escorts for three hours in that tree's hollow. Which tree's hollow? I mean, that doesn't look like a good place to hide. Broke Rock Way Shrine. <coughs> I always wanted to climb those guard towers. Father never let me. Just climb them when he's not looking. I mean, that's what everybody else with overprotective parents does. Quit complaining. Back at Emino's station? No, absolutely not. I cannot have you getting underfoot. Go to your room. I bring an adventurer to help, Father, and you send me to my room? Ugh! <sighs> Why couldn't Marilyn stay with her mother? I don't have any sentries to spare on her protection. Adventurer. When I was a kid, on Since cold nights, anyway, I used to curl up by the fire speak. in the Castle Navir Main Come Hall. Here. I'd sit there with a book and fall asleep over the pages. <laughs> Simpler times, eh? Well, thanks for the story, Isabel. You're the adventurer who escorted Marilyn here. I suppose I should thank you for ensuring her safety. I'm surprised that you're not a tall tale like the others she invented to get away from her bodyguards when she was younger. You must be Marilyn's father. I have that singular fortune. My wife is away in treating House Mornard for more centuries. She's better at handling Marilyn. I don't agree with my daughter's actions, but her instinct to bring you here was good. I could use your skills. Marilyn said there was something going on in the mine. And now, my daughter is sharing our secrets. Yes, the mine <laughs> is in a state of disarray. Creatures known as Hadalids invaded the lower tunnels. Work stopped. Sentries and prisoners are dead. I can barely hold the mine with the forces I have left. <laughs> so obviously she just snuck away while we were talking to him. What do you want me to do? Give me your map. The towers around the mine reported that a caravan laden with medical supplies was drawing near. They have yet to arrive. Find out what's keeping them. We're desperately low on bandages. Don't dally. All right, I'll find the missing supply caravan. If we don't manage to quell the Hadalit invasion, I'm going to have to abandon the mine. House Mornard will not be pleased. You're the overseer of this mine? I am. Many years ago, I was only a warden working at Amino Station. House Mornard took note of my work and gave me leave to oversee Broke Rock Mine. They treat my family and I well. In return, the mine supplies them with precious ammonites. Those who work for you are prisoners? Prisoners swing the pickaxes while sentries keep an eye on things and organize work in the tunnels. Don't be fooled by misplaced compassion. The prisoners deserve their sentences, and my mind provides them with protection, food, and pay. Where did the Hadalids come from? The Hadalids' origins are a mystery and not my concern. Dealing with their infestation is my priority. Nothing holds them at bay. Enough talk. Our tasks require attention. Go. 
find my missing supplies. Okay. Help someone. Where is she? The trail the caravans use is just up ahead. Maybe we'll be able to see where they are from there. Resonance crystals? The caravan? Where is everyone? Oh, there's a chest. Oh, Giselle. he's. Derek! No, 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 no. I'm going to see if I can. I could steal it while it maybe he'd fail at the lock and I could grab it. She they're gone. Dead. How could this happen? Is this a supply caravan? It was so close to the mine. What attacked them? It looks like a beast tore them apart. But which one? Could, could it be the Hadalids? You think Hadalids did this? It couldn't have been the prisoner gangs. They left a lot of supplies behind. Is this what adventuring is like? Yeah. Seeing the people you grew up with like this? Exactly. The Hadalids might still be around here. I'm not going to leave without singing a song to honor my friends. These crystals will project my voice to the other carts. Would you check for the supplies while I sing? Sure. I see the other carts to the left. I'll look for the medical supplies. I hope this song brings your spirits peace. Sack of tinctures. Caravan medical supplies. A bundle of herbs, bandages, and tinctures. Found at the site of the wrecked caravan outside Broke Rock Mine Camp. Well, she can definitely sing well. Have the supplies. I'm nearly. Ah, look on the ridge. There. Okay. Monsters, hadolids. There was blood on their claws. Were they coming to kill me? Were those crystals glowing? Resonance crystals. The prisoners carry them to amplify the mine sounds and help warn them of any collapses. But I use them to make my songs louder, too. Did the glow scare the Hadalids off? No. It was the music. Your music scared off the Hadalids? I think so. Or it calmed them enough that they left peacefully? Pux! I never finished the song! I'll have to start from the beginning now. What if the Hadalids come back? I'll find more resonance crystals. Their power and my song will keep me safe, and I'm going to honor my friends, monsters or not. You should go back to the camp. Tell father what happened here. Okay, I'll tell you father what we found. I'll catch up to you once the song's done. Uh, she's probably gonna get captured by Hadalids. Can't go in there, okay. Yeah, cause she's singing the song, they're gonna think her song is pretty, and they're just gonna take her, kidnap her. What are these? I mean, they're assassin beetles. I've fought them earlier, but I've just never really paid attention to what they're called. Your father. The Hadolids attacked. What happened? The Overseer. 
He was forced into the mine during the attack. They dragged him into the mine? No time to lose, friend. We drove the Hadalids back into the mine with everything we had. Swords, fists, rocks. The prisoners even used their pickaxes. But the Hadalids, their claws are just so sharp. Are you hurt? I'll survive. Not everyone was so lucky. We'll be digging graves tomorrow. Hopefully not for the Overseer, or his daughter. Please follow her. I can't do much to help against the Hadalids now. I'll follow Marilyn into the mine. Ah, my trusty adventurer friend. I felt rather foolish the moment I ran in here without you. Why didn't you wait for me? From what Enoch told me, it sounded like the attack just happened. Maybe if I'd been faster at the caravan, we could have rescued Father. Do you have a plan? No. I don't have your experience, but I am not going to twiddle my thumbs while Father's fate is decided. And if you don't think I can do this, I'll prove myself to both you and Father. Do you know how to navigate the mine? I explored the tunnels a lot when I was younger. At night, of course. I didn't want to be caught. Unless they dug new tunnels, I'll know where we are. Okay, let's go into the mine. There's a Hadalid. Tried to get out of that, but it was too late. Help! Someone help! Did you hear that? It sounded like it was coming from in here. Yvel! Stendar, blind me! What happened? Marilyn? You can't be in the Hadlands. They're coming back for us. Yvel, you're in no state to fight. Adventurer, we need a plan. Yes, we do. I don't know who you are, but take Marilyn out of here before the Hadalids come back. I've protected her for years. I'd hate to drag her into death with me. I think we probably need her. It hurts my leg. We're gonna need her to sing songs. I can't take her back. Yvel and the others are too hurt to fend off the Hadalids outside. I took some resonance crystals from the caravan. They should amplify my calming song. Do you still have the medical supplies? I still have the supplies. Good. Tend to them as best you can. I'll see if the song works on the Hadalids. I think I know what happened before and how to recreate it. What if the song doesn't work? I won't go far. If the Hadalids keep coming, I'll run to you and we'll make our stand. It'll be the two of us against all of them. No pressure. Right? I'll use the medical supplies to heal the wounded. I'll keep the Hadolids at bay. Patch up Ivel and the others. Thank you. It's already starting to ease my pain. Thank you. I'm sure that'll feel better in a few days' time. If any more monsters throw rocks at me, I'll be ready for them. No, Shujat did not like the taste of that. Ah, but no, Shujat never likes poison. The Hadalids are leaving. Marilyn? That song? The Hadalids aren't trying to get in anymore? It worked. Friend, check in with Yavel. I need to catch my breath. Oh, uh, I'm worried. Where did Marilyn learn to do something like that? That was completely different from when she would conjure butterflies in the gardens. Thanks to you both, we won't die in here. Will you and the others be able to make it out of here safely? Thoroughly and I know what we're doing. And that prisoner over there, Bellaton, is spoiling for a fight. We'll be fine. 
Besides, if you two made it here, then I'm sure the way back outside is safe enough. We'll go there and reinforce the camp. Overseer Barfil was dragged away in the Hadalit attack. Have you seen him? I didn't see him, no. But we heard those monsters screaming in pain. Couldn't make sense of it until now. The Overseer has a reputation for being fearsome in battle. The sounds disappeared deeper into the mine. We'll head deeper into the tunnels. Father, can't be far. Let's go. Wait, stop running ahead of me. I hope you, Val, and the others make it out of here safely. We still need to find Father. Who knows how long he's been in here fighting the Hadolids. He must be getting tired. He's probably dead. She's pretty naive. That's Father's dagger. He came this way. That's a piece of Father's cloak. We're definitely on the right path. One of father's personal guards. We need to find father quickly. I'm still alive. Father, are you hurt? Where are the Hadalids? Marilyn, she's here. Overseer Barthel, real adventurer, come here. I am safe. And you'd better be thanking my friend for seeing to that. I spent my entire life keeping Marilyn out of harm's way. Did it matter? No. Here she is, deep within a mine, filled with horrible creatures who've already killed my best sentries. This is a disaster. How did you manage to find me? We tracked your battle with the Hadalids through the tunnels. Marilyn saw all of that and she's still in here? No. Why am I surprised? Of course she'd stay. I held off those foul beasts as long as I could. Do whatever you can to get them out of my mind. What do you have in mind? They must have some reason to remain here. Kill them. Poison the tunnels. I don't care. I am leaving, and I'm taking my daughter and all my sentries with me. It's far too dangerous here. You believe Marilyn will leave with you? Marilyn still thinks the prisoners here are her friends. She never fully understood the dangers of Aminos. And I wouldn't be a good father if I left her to discover it now. Don't leave these tunnels until they're safe. I'll deal with the Hadalids. Oh, friend, I have an idea. Here, take the Resonance Crystals. These are the ones I took from the caravan site. They are the key to everything. How will the Resonance Crystals help? I can calm the Hadalids with my magic. With the Resonance Crystals amplifying the song, we can get more of the Hadalids to stop attacking us. But I think I can get them to do something else, too. What's your plan? My plan? I'm going to change the nature of the spell. Make it so the Hadalids aren't just calmer, but they don't want to be in the mine at all. I'm sure I can convince some of them to leave. You can do that? I'm a Thama vocalist, remember? My music casts magic. If I can change my lyrics, I can get the spell to change, too. We'd need to place a lot of resonance crystals. I know just the spots. And we'll need to find the entrance the Hadalids use. Okay, let's find some Hadalids. Father, we're going in to deal with the Hadalids. Leave the Hadalids in the hands of a capable adventurer. You're staying with me. I won't let my friend face the Hadalids alone. Young lady, you will listen to your father. I fared better against the Hadalids than you or anyone else. I'm going deeper into the mine. You can make it out on your own. This is a better way to go. Looks like 
like another treasure chest. long ways to go to get to this one quest objective down here. must be the deepest one. Look for some loose dirt to place the crystals. Did the Havilids attack because of the noise? Mines are loud places. is up here. could be down below or it could be above um, looks like I have to go down These are pretty cool enemies. I wonder if we'll have them in uh, some dungeon in the future or something. Uh, it's, like it's gonna crash again. crash like last time. Alright, should I go right or left? Right. Near the shore now. Maybe tunneling here angered the Havilids. The entryway has to be close.
These crystals are set. Let's look for the entryway. Maybe it's upstairs. Okay, looks like it. Judging from the map, looks like that is correct. Almost there. Up there. They have to be coming from those holes. Let me get a better view. A battle to remember. Yes. All right. Place the crystals. I'll start the song. That was the Hadalid Matron. Father will be waiting for us at the camp. Use that door down there. That'll take you outside. Uh, I gotta fight the matron again. Uh. I'm hurt bad. No! How dare you kill my companion! Isabel! Oh, you're okay. All right. Um. Okay, I need to get to Broke Rock Mine Camp, which I guess is on the other side of this. Where's this? Is this my objective? This is the other objective. The quest took me all the way over here, so let's see if I can find out what I'm supposed to do here. I'm supposed to reach the shore. Alright, I'm just going to come back and go back to the shore once I turn this in. proved more capable than I thought. Your mother was right in sending for you. I'm capable? Does this mean you'll let me go on adventures? Ah, adventurer. Come over here, if you please. You heard what father said? He thinks I'm capable. He might let me go on more adventures. I'll be able to help people. Talk to him, please. I want to hear what else he has to say about me. Thank you. Marilene told me some of what occurred with the Hadalids. I'd like to believe it was all your doing, but maybe it's time for me to reconsider my approach to our discussions. Her magic has its uses. Yes, it does. What will happen to the mine now? If my wife was successful in her negotiations with House Mornard, she'll return with enough sentries to replace the ones we lost. With the Hadalids calmer due to Marilyn's song, 
My sentries will be able to fight them off in due course. Good. Are you worried that more Adelids will come into the mine? If they do, we'll be ready for them. I'll come up with a strategy to further deal with the infestation tonight and speak with the sentries. No one will be caught unaware again. Sounds like you'll have to mine up. You'll have to... You'll have the mine up and running in no time. That's my job. Marilyn is excited to talk to you. I suggest you say your farewells before you head back out to your uh, adventuring. We did it! Once the prisoners and sentries recover, they'll be able to return to work. Without having to worry about being attacked, too. The new song did what you thought it would? My plan worked. Or it looks like it's working. You believed in me even though I know I wasn't entirely prepared for this adventure. At least I wasn't when we set off. Thank you. Take this. It's from my father and I. I can't believe it. We did it. I did it! I always knew I could use my magic to help people, but now we proved it! I can be an adventurer! Is that what you want to do in the future? The future? It's what I want to do now. Look at all the good we did here. We saved the mine! Where do you think you'll go? Somewhere where no one knows who I am or who my father is. When I leave, I don't want to feel like I'm still proving myself to him. I'll be an adventurer in my own right. Maybe Kefram. Or... or Somerset. Ships sail to those shores all the time. Do you think your father will let you go? I hope it doesn't come to that. We'll talk, work through our disagreements. But if he goes back to being a stubborn mule, then I'll have no choice but to leave anyway. The world needs my skills. I'm not going to be content here. All right. I hope she does well as an adventurer. She definitely has some skills. But it's dangerous work. All right, let's go to the northeast shore. Here we go. Finally, we're going to finally get to the northeast shore. Continue the main story. Fight. Well, if you win. Oh. Uh, it's Casca. Careful, Walker. All that swimming and fighting has made me hungry. And you look pretty tasty, I must say. I'm not here to fight you. You're Casca, right? Zaji's been very worried about you. You know Zaji? And he's alive? It's good to hear. Now I can kill him for getting us wrecked as soon as I see him. <laughs> When the storm hit, it was all I could do to hang on to some wreckage and make it to this beach. We're on Amnos, right? Yes, this is the prison island. I came to find you and the three Alliance leaders. The Alliance leaders, right. I keep meaning to try to find Queen Irene, but every time I get started, more of those prison mongrels rush out of the jungle and attack me. I love a good fight as much as the next sailor, but I'm exhausted. We could search for the Queen and the others together. Sure. Two noses are better than one. If we can pick up Queen Irene's scent, I can track her. That's sort of my specialty. The nose knows, as the kittens say. <laughs> Stay close and follow me. Right behind you, Casca. Let's look around. If I catch a familiar scent, I can follow it. How did you and Zaji get picked to transport Queen Irene to the Peace Conference? Peace Conference? Is that what this is all about? Zaji received orders from the Crown. I guess we were conscripted. Once I learned that our passenger was Queen Irene, I was dumbfounded that she chose the perfect pounds. Proud, but dumbfounded. All right, I'm following you, Casca. Go. Let's look around. If I catch a familiar sign. Alright, same thing. Crude shelter. What have we got here? 
Someone used this shelter recently. Their scent is fresh. Familiar. This way. Let me take a sniff. Oh. The remains of a fire. There are tracks here. This way. Disturbed sand. Give me a moment. There was a fight here. What's that? On the ground. Invitation medallion. A heavy medallion inscribed with runes connected to a chain. That was one of the nobles. That medallion has the queen's ascent all over it. There! I have her trail. Follow me. The queen is in danger. Oh no. This chamber is dangerous, Esther. His new friend shouldn't be wandering about. Nice. What did you find? Queen Irene? Fair day and Oriel's blessing to you. I am Irene Arana Aldmeri, Queen of the Aldmeri Dominion. You have my apologies, friend of Casca. I must stink worse than a three-day dead Gua right now. That's all right. Lady Arabelle sent me to find you and the other Alliance leaders. Ah, Lady Arabelle. I knew she wouldn't leave us to rot in this jungle. But she only sent you. Not an army or a chivalry of knights. No matter. I welcome the company. Trouncing these green serpent bastards is amusing, but I'm starting to grow weary. I can signal a rescue ship as soon as we find High King Emmerich and Prince Ernskar. Ah, uh, yes. We were together for a time, but we argued and he rushed off in a huff. I believe I know where to find him after we make some preparations for our rescue. You can signal a ship, but I can help calm the storm that hugs the coast. You can? How can you do that? Never heard about my time with the Sea Elf Pirates. They taught me some weather magic. Could you get what I need for the ritual? A claw from a volcanic beast, a feather, and the bones of a drowned sailor. Sadly, these beaches are thick with those. Yeah, that's sad. I'll find the items you need for your weather ritual. Gather the claw, a feather, and the bones, and I'll make sure the rescue ship can reach the shore safely. While you're gone, I want to take a look at Casca's wounds. She won't admit it, but I can see that she's hurt pretty badly. You're really the leader of the Aldmeri Dominion? I am. I founded our alliance right after I accepted my dead father's crown. Anything else you want to know? We are still lost in a hostile jungle, in case you haven't noticed. Oh. Casper, you know, Queen Iren seems like Let the kind of person I'd like to get an ale with. Ren, you gonna talk to me more? Oh, that's Helena Shadow Song. Where's Queen Iren? Did she leave? Oh man, I didn't get to talk to her more. Alright, I'm gonna end the video right here. In the next episode, we will gather the ritual items for Queen Iren, and then we will try to find Prince Ernskar and. Prince Ernskar and um, whoever is um, it's High King Emmerich. Prince Ernskar and High King Emmerich. Thanks for watching. See you next time.